to uh, train on a bike. Oh, I might to that. fly an airplane because we've got a velodrome inside. Right. An aircraft hangar. Oh, right. I'm bigger than I thought. Well, it's 133 metres. See, when you go into the bend, you feel the G-force getting it. Assuming you get past it. We've yeah. estimated that the weight of the plane, with you on it, is about 110 kilograms. Yeah. Um, we've uh, calculated what the drag of the aircraft is. Um, and the lift of the aircraft is, and if we put those together, we can figure out the power needed to fly in steady level flight. Yeah. We reckon you need to fly about 450 watts for three minutes. Mm -hmm. And that's all we're doing. Yeah. Guy needs to prove he can produce 450 watts, the sort of power Bradley Wiggins would look to produce on a mountain stage at the Tour de France. But Guy only needs to sustain that for around three minutes. This speed record is placed for about 15 laps. In the time that it takes me to do 15 miles, that's what the whole record that's attempt, whole record attempt would be. I'm all for a challenge. What are we doing now? We're doing it now. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Three, two, one. <coughs> for Guy to keep his eye on is a large number on the left showing the wattage he's producing. And he starts well, building up to over 500 watts on his first lap. I didn't know what sort of effort it was going to be able to take to do 500 watts. I could see that the, 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 the story gate might go on that handle down and I thought I'd be fine. 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 I thought I'd be fine.